much for joining us here on The Talk. I'm Marion Brooks. Two outstanding high school students join us to talk about their award-winning business plans. And then later on, they're young, smart, and motivated. The future business leaders that you will need to meet. Coming up next. Stay with us. Well, coming up after the break, they may still be in high school, but they are making their mark in the business world already. Get to know these young innovators and the organization that helped put them on the right path. All coming up next. Founders Foundation is an organization that helps underserved, underserved kids not only explore careers, but helps them become young entrepreneurs. The organization recently had its seventh annual Future Founders Citywide Business Plan Competition, where two outstanding visionaries won top honors for their unique business ideas. Check it out. Territory Records is an online music production company that offers customizable jingles and many different genres of beats and instrumental for sale. The responsibility of Stick is to provide a product that helps save both money and food. And joining me now are the winners, Stevie Bailey. Steve, Stevie Bailey. I thought I was going to mess up your name. <laughs> Attila Wilson and Scott Eisen, who is the CEO of the Future Founders Foundation. Okay. Here's your chance, Stevie. Tell us about you won in the technology yes. uh, category. Tell us about your idea. Well, the name of my company is called Tentray Records. And we are a music production company that offer customizable jingles and many different genres of beats and instrumentals for sale. So mainly what we do, we offer jingles like the background music for, for commercials, advertisements, and things of that sort. Mm -hmm. And we also offer um, the beats as well for artists and um, companies all over. Okay, so say I wanted to do my own uh, background music, I would pick out of your jingles or would I put my beats together? Um, actually, you'll be able to visit our website, mm -hmm. which is tentrayproductions.com, and you will be able to select um, certain productions from, a, from, off our, from off of our website. Okay. And um, you can also fill out a form for customizable jingles and beats as well. And we'll be able to um, get back to you and go from there. Oh, very cool. All right, Angela, now what you want in the product division. Yes. Tell us about your product. Well, my business is based off a product that I've invented called Stick and Zips, which are resealable adhesive strips that you can attach to different bag food items, such as maybe a chip bag or a cereal bag. And when you apply the strip, you will be able to seal the bag and save the food inside and preventing it from becoming stale or from wasting the food and having to transfer your food to a food storage bag. Okay, now you have yes, these... one of them with you right now. So yes. how do you adhere them to the bag? Well, it's, um, it's kind of a two-step thing. And what you would do is you would first peel apart the strip. So that's like plastic, like, like tape? Yeah, mm -hmm. and then there's a heat stick bag on each side of the strip. Uh, and then they stick together? Yes, okay. and you will apply this on the upper vents of the bag that you have. So and then it makes it resealable? Yes, oh. it's kind of like putting your bag foods into a food storage bag, but without the extra bag. So that's good for recycling and all that, yes. too, because you're not wasting more plastic with a plastic bag. Definitely. Fantastic Thank ideas. You. <laughs> all right, so tell us about this, your program, what your program's mission is, Steve, uh, Sean. I'm sure. sorry. Scott, Scott, that's OK. I knew it was Scott. <laughs> it's OK. Um, well, Future Founders is all about connecting this generation of entrepreneurs with the next generation. And I think so often, um, individuals need to meet someone in their chosen career field before they want to consider a career in that field. And what we saw, there's a lot of data out there showing that students, specifically in low-income areas, don't always have access to entrepreneurs, and sure. they've never met an entrepreneur. So what we did uh, seven years ago through a partnership with the Network for Teaching Entrepreneurship was to create a program where we can leverage corporate relationships such as Motorola Solutions, Motorola Mobility, AT&T, Ford, Microsoft, et cetera, and connect them as well as entrepreneurs that you might see on in the news or right here on NBC with these students so that they can see entrepreneurship as a viable career option. That is fantastic. How did you, what did you get from this process, Stevie? Did you learn anything through, obviously you started your company, yes. but what did you learn in the process? Um, one of the things that I learned in the process is that I'm able to do anything that I can put my mind to. And I always heard people say it, but that's just one thing that I heard people say. I didn't really believe it. Um, 
And with this program, it helped me believe and achieve to, that I can do anything that I want to do and that I can put my mind to and be an actual entrepreneur and be successful at it. And Adela, what about you? Was there anybody in particular that influenced you throughout this process? Mm -hmm. Just about all the mentors with Future Founders and my teacher as well, Mr. Scott Stewart. And basically they just, they just helped me see my goals, like get a clear vision on it and make sure that I go for those goals and don't let them go. Like to, because starting out with the business plan, I kind of got frustrated and was sometimes not so, not so, I'm sorry, a little lost words, but not so motivated. wanting to go for motivated or going for my idea. Sometimes I would get mad that maybe it's not gonna work and mm -hmm. they just kind of gave me the confidence and encouraged me to go forward with my ideas or anything that I want to do, period. That is fantastic. I love this idea because I think that <laughs> entrepreneurship, you. as you said, it's the backbone of our economy and small businesses help employ the most people. So you mm -hmm. guys are on track to do amazing things. And just believing in yourself yeah. is, you know, half the battle sometimes. And it's so easy to get involved. I mean, if everyone in the community, whether they're an entrepreneur or a business leader, would just volunteer time, go out to one of the schools, we offer easy ways on our website, futurefounders.com. There's many organizations because it really makes a difference. And it I does. think both X1 and Stevie are on course for, for big things in the future. I think you're right, really? Scott. Scott, Atlas, Stevie, thank you all so much for coming thank on. Thank you. We thank you so much. Time. And congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. We're watching thank you. for you guys. Thank you. All right.